Sweep accounts. This term has a particular use in Treasury and it's one of the most frequently misused terms. You need to get this term right so you're not embarrassed when you meet with your bankers. So many people use the term sweep incorrectly. What does sweep mean in Treasury parlance? In Treasury terms, in Treasury language, sweep refers to the movement of funds from an account to an investment vehicle or an investment account. It can also be used to draw funds from a line of credit or to pay down to a line of credit. So it simply refers to that type of movement. Hi, I'm the Thought Bubble. This is what you were thinking. How much starch is in that shirt? It does not refer to a ZBA movement or the simple mobilization of funds, but it always refers to a movement between an account and investment or pulling from a line. Hey, this is important. Listen up. Why do you keep saying investment or line of credit account? Well, the movement of excess funds, you're going to, your best use of those funds is to either pay down debt or to invest them, depending on your situation and depending on what your needs are. So the fact that you have excess funds, you want the system to automatically move and make those decisions for you to pay a line of credit. If you're borrowing money from a bank, you want those funds to be paid back as quickly as possible. A sweep allows you to do that in most banks. Any excess funds over that line of credit, you're typically going to want them to be put into an investment vehicle. That's what a sweep allows you to do. Sweep? What is he talking about? How is that different from funds mobilization? Well, funds mobilization gets all the, the funds into that concentration account, as you see in the diagram. The sweep will move those funds from the concentration account to the investment or line of credit, shown horizontally. What are the requirements to have a sweep account service? That's a great question, and your bankers can usually tell you the specific details for that in terms of the agreements. But what you need to have is you need to have a clear mobilization uh, structure in your organization that actually moves the funds to that concentration account. Then the, the maximized amount of funds can be sent to your investment or to pay down your line, or the minimum amount of borrowings needs to occur. What are the benefits of a sweep account? It's the optimization of cash usage in your organization, reducing borrowings, maximizing your investments. What should I remember about sweep? Well, to impress your bankers, you're certainly going to want to know that sweep refers to moving funds to an investment account and, or, uh, and to or from a line of credit. And that this is a, an effective tool that your organization may be able to use. In late 2003 and 2004, many organizations turned off their sweep accounts because the investment yields that they could earn by leaving balances at the bank exceeded what they were paid on some sweep accounts. Now that has in 2005 begun to change. However, it's important to know that this analysis of when to have a sweep account and when not to have a sweep account is a worthwhile consideration.